We're here doing a test with mosquito free water. The product is designed to take water tension off of water, be it from a bird bath, fountain, pond, lake, lagoon, any body of water. Um, and it just needs to be topically applied uh, through a backpack sprayer or a handheld sprayer, as you see here. Uh, what we're, we're going to be testing with is uh, the liter bottle, wouldn't matter which product we pulled. Uh, this one is just a little bit easier for us to dispense. We'll put some into our beaker. And we have a um, quart jar of regular well water. Uh, it could be, wouldn't matter if it was well water or city water. Uh, all water will have what we call as a water tension. And that is if you've ever filled a glass up, you'll see where it actually beads off the, the top. We have some ants we've collected over the weekend. Uh, this weekend is, uh, or today's date is actually April 18th, 2016. Um, so these ants are kind of out early. We are here in the Wisconsin area. Uh, they're not fire ants. I used to like testing with fire ants. A little easier to work with. These are good old black carbon ants. Let's see if we can get one to come up on our little probe. They were fed all night long with some good sugar-based um, water. I think they kind of got themselves a little inebriated. Come on. A little easier to get them to um, cooperate. Now you'll see that he is floating on the surface. Be it a mosquito, fly, uh, bee, whatever. Uh, he's going to remain on the top. We're not going to sacrifice him. I don't want to lose him, so we can actually bring him back to life. This is the mosquito-free water. Um, once dispensed or sprayed, we'll make sure that all water is, is done. A little hard to see. But you see he's no longer on the surface. And if this were a mosquito, um, you're going to find the same thing. That uh, be it a, an adult mosquito trying to lay its legs or a... Um, we're going to bring him back to life. If you've ever been in college, we did the fly test where you drown a fly and then bury him in salt. The salt actually pulls the moisture out of the ant and will bring him back to life. That's not the experiment we're showing today, but again, we didn't want to sacrifice any ants. That is the mosquito-free water. The mosquito can no longer land on the water. Once it does, it actually sinks. The good Lord didn't teach it nor, nor how to swim, nor did it teach the ant how to swim. If it had the stages of the mosquito, it goes from the egg, larvae, pupa, adult. The pupa, uh, once it gets to the larvae stage, just lives in the actual body of water. The pupa then will come to the surface and it has a breathing tube that breathes off the surface. If there's no water tension allowed for it to bring that tube up, it also is going to sink and drown. And in the case of the adult, well again, it would never get to that far because we've stopped it from the mosquito actually landing on a body of water. So when you see tires in your backyard, bird baths, fountains, ponds, any type of stagnant water, this is the product to use.